Welcome to Introduction to Structural Materials Selection and Economics. I'm Tom Eager, a professor of materials engineering and engineering management at MIT. I'm excited to share with you my experience from more than 40 years at MIT investigating structural materials and teaching and advising people about their selection. Structural materials are literally the foundation and backbone of our modern world. Chances are you're already familiar with the most common structural materials out there, like wood and stone, concrete and steel. We've been using these materials in very large quantities for ages. But today, these kinds of traditional structural materials are being improved and even supplanted by an ever-growing number of new and more exotic materials. In everything from buildings and airplanes to spacecraft and sports, we frequently see materials such as aluminum and glass, foamed aluminum, plastics, and advanced composites, supplanting other materials and taking new roles in our modern world. So if you're developing or designing something new, say a new product for a company, how do you know which structural material to use? Selecting the right structural material can literally make or break your company. But with all the choices out there, how do you evaluate structural materials? to find the right one for your particular application. In this class, you'll learn how to answer those questions as we investigate the science behind the selection of structural materials. We'll examine the key factors that go into this decision, from materials properties, to its availability and cost, to its repairability, maintainability, and the economics of the industry where it will be used. We'll look at how to evaluate external factors, such as political, social and environmental concerns that may limit the use of some materials and make others more desirable. Manufacturers make all kinds of claims about new structural materials. Sometimes they're right and other times they're wildly off base. Through examples from specific industries you'll learn how to assess these claims so you can figure out which materials are right for a given job and just as importantly which ones are not. This is a class for anyone who deals with structural materials, either directly or indirectly. From civil engineers to mechanical engineers to chemical engineers, architects, product developers, and designers, as well as those interested in investing in these new materials technologies. The lessons you'll learn can be applied across many different kinds of industries. So I hope you'll join us for Introduction to Structural Materials and Economics.